I'm Don Elkins. This is your WBOC Early Morning Vidcast for Friday, May 20th, 2011. Here's a quick look at what's happening. Well, the development yesterday in the case against former pediatrician Earl Bradley, who stands accused of having sexually assaulted more than 100 of his young patients. The Newcastle County Courthouse confirms the Bradley trial will return to Georgetown in Sussex County. The judge originally moved the case to Wilmington because of worries over jury selection. However, Bradley has waived his right to a jury trial. The court says the trial will start June 1st once again in Sussex County. Well, there's some improvement, but apparently we've got a long way to go. That was the update yesterday on the state of the Salisbury area economy. Dave Ryan from the Salisbury Wicomico Economic Development Group told members of the Salisbury Chamber one big hurdle, the number of existing homes still on the market. He says as that inventory declines, there'll be more construction and perhaps other jobs created. Ryan says things are looking better, but it still will take another couple of years to get Salisbury back on track. A proposal for an offshore wind farm in Delaware has some people worried. Leaders in Bethany Beach say they want the developer to pay for an impact study before putting power lines underground near homes. The developer NRG Blue Water Winds says the lines would connect the turbines to a Sussex County power station. The homeowners say they worry about their health and property values. I think it, the responsibility lies with the wind farm people. They want to do this. They got to prove to us, the town people, that it's not going to have a, a negative impact in any way on us and our town. In a statement today, an NRG spokesman said our understanding with the Bethany Town leadership was that before NRG consented to pay for any study or studies, we'd be told the scope of work, when they'd be completed and the final cost. We are currently in talks with the town's representatives about those details and hope to have them resolved soon. That is all for us. Thanks for joining us online and have a great Friday.